So then, we got a major, massive, huge Mondo surprise. They're coming off of a little video package thing. And all of a sudden, we hear... I got the... And John Cena's music's playing. And I'm like, what? What? John Cena? What the hell is he doing out here? Crowd loses their ever-loving mind. John Cena makes his way out to the ring and says, Surprise! Cena himself was surprised because he's used to hearing John Cena sucks from the crowd, but instead they were singing his song word for word. Cena said this was the first premium live event in London in, well, over 20 years. Cena asked, quote, what the heck took so long to spend some time with you? Crowd cheered. Cena said that it wasn't up to him, though. It was up to the decision makers who didn't know how to feel about London. Cena said, quote, they think this is a hostile environment and the crowd can be a bit of a distraction. Cena said the crowd wasn't a distraction and they were the show. Cena said that he wanted the world to know that they were underappreciated. Cena was big on respect, and over the last 20 years, the fans have earned his respect. They loudly started chanting, thank you, Cena. Cena again said they don't like it when the performers stop to let the crowd cheer for them. And that's what made nights like this very special. Cena said that there was no crowd more exciting than the crowd in London, England. Cena then said, quote, I'm here to try to bring WrestleMania to London. The crowd absolutely lost their ever-loving minds with yes chance. Cena encouraged the crowd to let them know loud and proud, you want WrestleMania in London. And Cena's pushing this and pushing this and pushing this so hard that I'm pretty sure it's happening. Not next year because they're going to be in Philly. Maybe 2025 for WrestleMania 41. Maybe 2026 for WrestleMania 42. But they're not going to come out here and push it so hard, so hard, and not have it in some sort of plan or be trying to do it. Triple H said anything is possible in the, pre in the post show press conference and that he would love to do it, but it's a lot harder than anybody thinks. And I'm like, I get that. I get that. But you guys are doing it. I'm 90% sure they would not have had Cena come out here and cut this promo and do all this stuff just to not have some sort of a possibility or impossible plan to do it.